happy birthday as well. You always find the latest courtyard. Even in solution. In out of the box. Hello and welcome to Radio Waves by Dottabert. If you enjoy reviews, comparisons, band scans of new and classic portable radios, then make sure to subscribe and tap the bell icon so you don't miss any of my most excellent videos. In front of us is the Sea Crane CC Skywave 2, and I perform a daytime shortwave band scan. Yep, you heard it. Shortwave. Yeah, I haven't done it with this radio yet. We'll see what it can do. I'm pretty interested in what this external jack is and uh, how well it works. I only use the whip mainly. So yeah, let's check this radio out. Uh, so first we'll go over features, second we'll do a size comparison, and third we'll start cruising the daytime shortwave band. So here it is, the Sea Crane CC Skywave 2. I think you pick it up for around 99 bucks. Not bad. If I have links, I'll put them down below in the paid links section. Awesome. So let's go ahead and check out the radio. We got a wrist strap. We have the new antenna jack for shortwave and FM and airband. And we have the headphone jack, which is awesome for listening with headphones for FM stereo. We have micro USB input for charging the batteries. Going to the front, say crane. I think we've got about a one and a half inch speaker there. We've got our display showing the current time is 922. That is a uh, central daylight time near Chicago, Illinois, USA. Of course, it's AM clock. Power sleep function button, AM FM with weather alert. As you can see, it's AM FM stereo weather airband shortwave. And over here, we have our numeric keypad for direct entry frequencies. And as you can see, you got orange writing below with extra things it can do, like toggling stereo, stereo on and off, uh, 9 kilohertz, 10 kilohertz stepping can change, charging the radio, alarm set, time set, turning the alarm on and off, a tone control, ATS system, auto-tune storage, and our 12-hour, 24-hour clock change. And down here, um, you can see we got a weather shortwave airband dedicated button, frequency button, so you hit that, hit the desired frequency, and hit frequency again, page function for your memories, so yeah, it's pretty neat, uh, pretty basic. Here you can do some incremental tuning and browse tuning with the buttons if you don't want to use a tuning knob. Over here, it's a push button, so we can go fast, slow, and then um, we can do squelch if we're doing airband. Volume, top of the radio, we have our antenna. I believe it's uh, 20 inches, don't quote me on that. I didn't look at it, but you know, you get it. There it is. Yep, fast, slow tuning, air squelch when you push it in. There's your frequency coverage. Our shortwave is 2.3 to 26.1. Not bad. Runs on two AA batteries. Expect a runtime of 70 hours. Gotta love it. So, yeah, quick size comparison. Yeah, you guys have seen this before, but CC Pocket. We got a deck of cards. Iron Man. He's the man with the master plan. He loves Sea Crane shortwave radios from California land. Yeah, they're based in California. Awesome. It's Iron Man. All right, cool. That's about what we're going to do for size comparison. Now, cool thing is I got a new antenna from Paul. Thank you, Paul. The Fezziquin AN03. I think this is the Texan variety as well. It looks kind of identical, just a different writing on there. So, yeah, um, he sent it to me when I just bought the Kato T1 wire. It's pretty funny. I just bought a new Kato T1 wire to string out there because my old one's about six years old. I figured time to replace it. Same uh, length, I believe. This is a low-cost one. Um, it's a little thinner wire, gauge wire, so we'll see how it performs. So thanks, Paul. Appreciate the donation. I did string it up for this video, so we'll see how it goes. All right. So, yeah, feature-wise, pretty cool. Um, this size comparison. So let's go ahead and start cruising the shortwave band. So I'm going to hook up this wire here to the side of the radio. Plug it in, and I'll just quickly go through and see how long this takes us. Probably not too long, but we'll see. Power. Okay, 5 megahertz. Saw the current time. There it is again. Chicago, Illinois, USA. This is WWV for Collins, Colorado on 5 megahertz. Let's go ahead and tune up. Here what we can find. I know I, I picked up Canada, so let's see if we can pick that up again. Uh, early in the morning, It's this isn't too early, but early enough that some of these signals are still coming in. There we go. Do our bandwidth control. Frequency, antenna strength. A voice mode, fast tuning. Cool. Yeah, it was Canada. Nice. 
see what else we can pick up. Yeah, it's a cool little setup and uh, you know, a little wire. It's working out good. Strung it out there. No big deal. Out to my balcony. It's to the right here. And uh, yeah, we got room light. We're going to have the lights on. This is all sunlight. So this is a good little setup. Got your little radio with you and off you go. You are listening to World's Last Chance Radio on WBCQ at 93.30 kHz on the 31 meter band. World's Last Chance Radio, preparing a people for the Savior's soon return. The longing of every Christian since Yahushua's return. So that was Maine, WBCQ. <laughs> So this is uh, WRMI, Okeechobee, Florida. So we'll see what else we can find with the Skywave 2. 2. Peace. <laughs> I like this radio. It's cool. Uh, you know, I always have it on my bench. I always use it for checking frequencies. Let's see if we can pick up 10. I skipped over that. Let's go. Enter in manual. So WWV on 10 megahertz. Nice. Antenna seems to be doing pretty good, this wire antenna. Yeah, it's a good setup. Guanajay, y por ese motivo no se podía comunicar con su familia o activistas. Tras más de dos semanas sin noticias del artista, la curadora de arte, Yanelice Núñez, informó haber recibido una llamada telefónica de otro. Alcántara. a este presidio político que ya dura dos años y nueve meses y que son las protestas como las huelgas de hambre o no hacer uso de sus llamadas reglamentarias le hacen sentir según Núñez la incomunicación fue un entrenamiento para fortalecer su capacidad precisó en ese sentido que Luis Manuel cool it's picking up quite a bit nice not sure where it'll pick up past 20 megahertz Pretty faint signal here. Keep going. Okay, music on 15.1. Okay, cool. Sounds like classical. Oh yeah, let's get 15 megahertz. Let's put that in. Nice and clear. Hours, 33 minutes, coordinated universal time. Cool, got the time, nice. So now you know what time it is, exactly. Is that classical music? 15.14. Yeah, cool little radio. 
at the amber lit screen. Of course, I like the stand it has on there. As you can see, when it stands up, real sharp display. When it's laid down like this, of course, it looks kind of fuzzy, but yeah. Should pick up something soon right around here. Maybe. Maybe not. Okay. Not broadcasting yet. So maybe we'll switch over an FM scan. Yeah. That'll be fun. I may have to look that up. I don't know what that is. So I'll put a pop up uh, if I can figure out what these uh, stations are. Broadcasting stations on shortwave. I think we're almost done. Yeah, this went pretty quick. We'll try the airband too. Why not? Let's have some fun because uh, the antenna works for the airband as well. Okay, so now we're at the bottom of the shortwave. So we'll stop it here. Let's uh, go to right here. Airband. And see, squelch is on. I think I got it where I can just... Do I have anything in here? Let's see if I have any presets. It's two. Chicago Gate 9 to 399, second level 340. Nice. Yes, yeah, that squelch kicks in pretty good. And we just heard some air uh, traffic there, or ground control. Cool. I like that. Um, let's go to page one. I think that's where I got a lot of presets. Page one. Okay, so let's just cycle through here. Oh. Of course, I miss it. This radio doesn't have the scanning feature. The single sideband uh, radio does. Uh, CC Skywave single sideband 2. Yeah, it has uh, a 10 channel scanner, which is nice. So you could actually, I think, hit both these buttons and it automatically scans the page you're on. Which is pretty nice. So, quite a bit of air activity since we're during the day. Cycle through here. So we get any activity. So you get the idea. Nice. Defaulted to my preset 10 on page 2. Heard him talking. Okay, we're going to go to FM here in a second, just because this airband is fun. Do enjoy it. So. Here you go, get any idea how this works? Cool. Alright, having a skyway is neat. Okay, so let's go to FM. Yeah, FM, FM. All right. So FM, it's AM. Our, our partners in departments of transportation. So we will go to the bottom of the band. I think we can go 8775. I don't know if we, yeah, let me do that. Yeah, slow tune it. self-driving semi-trucks be on the road in other regions of the country. This is what... No, no, no. The serpent. Yeah. Trucks be on the road in other regions of the country. This is 1A. We'll be right back. Oh, 
vocalists uh, Abigail Rickards on Saturday. No, Janusz, ja dlatego, wiesz, mam wiceprezesa, który jest jednym z najlepszych naszych golfistów. Tak. Ja myślałem, że tylko będę robił sprawy papierkowe, a Krzysiek... Yeah, I hit the page. Hello. Let's go back to our... No to już nie zapomnijmy, no jeden z najlepszych zawodników, którzy jeden potrafi najlepszy... 400 yardów uderzyć driverem. No, ja to, to widziałem. To jest masakra, no, widziałeś to? Widziałem to. No. Widziałem to, niesamowite. No, no Krzysiek mm -hmm. prawie swojego sąsiada stracił. XRT. Xfinity.com slash Timofax. Call one. But you can't be right here. So the browse is kind of missing some of the uh, stations, which is unfortunate. So you have to manually tune. That's all right. Well, uh, I'm sure that caller nine loves you right now because your loss is their game. Now they have some. At 773-279-2100 or WFMT.com. The Animals by Camille Saint-Souls and it's taken from our walk in nature. Embrace freshness with secret her body deal. House, and you will be darned if you have to expend that kind of energy. Gosh, <laughs> that the is such a great movie. Scene. To do that, you're macking on some chicken. You're like, you're Last day. That is how my son says she. Six feet on the screens and no one seems to hear a thing. Do you know that? With me, a wife to be. And the FAA wanting more information. The lawmakers will speak with the whistleblower during a hearing next week. We have time. So there it is, a C crane, CC Skywave 2, a little bit of scanning on the shortwave band. We did a little bit of air band and FM. Now, like I said, you can manually uh, tune it because yeah, it's missing quite a bit on the stations uh, and program them in because you get the 100 presets per. So that's not bad. Um, so yeah, definitely... Uh, use those pages of presets. Um, I actually like using them to put my favorites like during the day, favorites at night for a medium wave. I like that, same with short wave. Um, so having pages is nice uh, because you can put them in like many categories. So there it is. Uh, yeah, thank you, Paul, again for the Fezzequin AN03 or Texan AN03. I think it's the same thing. I really do because it comes with this adapter too as well. So the plug and then it has an adapter for hooking to your whip antenna. 
So, yeah, awesome. So there is this Skywave 2 in action during the day on the bench upstairs. So, yeah, here's them down in the basement. They're doing radio scans. So this is great to be up here doing this. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Give me a like if you did. If you like Skywave 2s, uh, hit subscribe to the bell icon. Get notified of future scans I do with it, uh, future reviews of C-Crane products. And, of course, three comment below. We think about the C-Crane CC Skywave 2. Uh, do you have one? Do you like it? Do you use it? Uh, let me know. I know a lot of people were upset that this wasn't Type C. You know what? It doesn't bother me because I take my batteries out and charge them with a dedicated charger. That's just me. I mean, I know it's there, but I don't use it. So I don't know about you guys, but 70 hours gets me a lot of time. So I'm barely changing the battery or charging them. So yeah, that's me. So I'll go ahead and turn that off. And we have our current time pop up. Yeah, it's a great, great radio. Loving it. So there it is. So let me know down below what you think. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in my next video.